morning everyone, I'm Essex Dave. Join me on this walkabout around Kaduri district. This is Waterloo Road and the first thing you notice that there are a lot of banks in this area, like the Bank of China and Hang Seng Bank. Not forgetting Shanghai Commercial Bank. So the Bank of East Asia. The lovely Metro Park Hotel. With its lovely facade. And HSBC Bank. In the basement, the bottom of the Pentecostal Church. Further on down Waterloo Road, there's even more banks. The Standard Chartered Bank and the China Communications Bank. And the reason why there's so many banks here, carry on watching the video and I will explain. For me, this is one of the real highlights of Kaduri District. This is Pui Ching Mid Middle School. As we pan up, you can see Amazing staircase. The view from the opposite side of the road is even better. You can see the Art Deco influence, glass blocks, concrete staircase. I'm going to carry on along. This part is not as impressive, but later on there are some nicer buildings coming up. There's quite heavy traffic here because this is Puiching Road, a major cut through. But the buildings on the opposite side are also heavily Art Deco influenced and it's still all part of Puiching School. This part is the middle school. Just have one more look. It's really super impressive. As I come back down Huiting Road, just have a quick look at the Kowloon Library. And up ahead, you can see some low-rise blocks and this is the reason why there are so many banks and property agents in this area and I'll explain that a little bit in a minute so as you can see in the background there's one building covered in like blue netting so that's a new building that's going up and slightly over to the right hand side you can see another kind of darker building with nice balconies, that's another brand new building. So the reason why so many banks is this area is undergoing a lot of redevelopment. Old buildings are getting knocked down and new ones put up. So there is a lot of business here for the banks.
So I'm in Victory Avenue. And if you walk along here, you can get an idea of all the redevelopment that's going on. And you can also see lots of the old houses and buildings. Like these ones on the left, which are going to be the next kind of target building. On the right hand side you've got these very nice ones with nice balconies so before those old this area here where the new ones are look like the old ones let's carry on So they're all here side by side. There is a typical tenement building in this area. Any property developer would be eyeing that one, ready for demolition and building something new. Something new like this side. There's three developments here. This one is finished. The white one next door is half finished. blue one is just beginning. Again, you get the idea here. More old buildings ready. Directly opposite, brand new block. And it's not just happening in Victory Avenue, it's happening all over Kaduri District. And if you look down there at the dark building at the back, that's Woodhouse, which is one of my favourite developments in this area. If you are new to the channel, please consider subscribing. Hit that notifications bell so you don't miss out on any of my future content similar to this. One of the more standout buildings in Kaduri District is this church. It looks like a post-war building, maybe even before the war, it's like Art Deco style. This is the first Assembly of God Church and it looks pretty nice here this morning. Bathed in beautiful sunshine. With lovely blue sky. situated at the entrance to Kaduri Avenue and if you haven't done it yet check out my video on Kaduri Avenue link down below in the script description it's a really interesting place up there it's like an outdoor museum the real iconic building in this area is further up Argyle Street here at the end and it's the real landmark of this area and it's being preserved renovated at this moment so we're going to go and see it now
and it's the CL, old CLP office and clock tower built in Art Deco or Bauhaus style. I still haven't found out which one yet. Like I said, there is some construction work going on here. They're upgrading it into an electricity museum, but you can still get a good idea of how special, famous standout location in Kaduri district. And that's the famous clock tower there. And then there's a bit of scaffolding in front and there's a big machine behind as well. But just have another pan up. If you've enjoyed this video, please don't forget to like and to share it. As always, thanks so much for watching and I'll see you later.